Yes, sir. It's your boy JT, and I'm back again with another video today. Uh, before we get into this video, make sure you guys hit the like button. Make sure you guys subscribe. Make sure you guys continue to show love. If you haven't already, make sure you hit the notifications so you can be notified when my videos do go live because you know YouTube be on a bullshit. But anyway, hope you guys enjoy the video. Let's get to the intro. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are back again with another Madden 24 Ultimate Team video today, of course. In today's video, we're going to be going over the Golden Ticket Release 7. Um, so all these cards are going to be currently out in packs right now. We're going to be going over the X factors and the abilities and how much they actually cost currently in game. So that's what we're going to be doing. If you want to know the ratings of these players and what they come with and their attributes and all that, go to my previous video and then come back to this video and then you guys can check out the X factors and abilities. But um, as far as Golden Ticket Release 7, um, the cards that we have is going to be a QB William Perry, um, QB Jalen Hurts, a free safety eddie jackson and then we have a wide receiver oj howard which is kind of interesting because um the idea is that uh oj howard i think oj howard created this card himself because there isn't a out of position wide receiver oj howard card in the game it's only a tight end card so um pretty i'm pretty much the community itself pretty much thinks that oj howard possibly created his own card which is interesting but we're gonna go over these cards real fast but before we get into that um, let's go ahead and check out the store offer. So we can go ahead and go ahead and log into Madden real quick as it loads here. It's probably gonna take me to the catalog to watch. Okay, it's gonna take me straight to the store offer. So I don't know why the store offers are loading like that. Like Madden be buggy. All right, so here we go, store offers. So we do have a Crucible LTD opportunity packing game. I think that has I think that has been there for a minute. So, but here is the current release golden ticket bundle so it's going to be pretty pretty much the same just like every other week contains three times 95 plus overall elite players either one times 98 overall elite player or one times 99 overall golden ticket player from the most recent golden ticket release these packs are pretty much the same this is the probability for the 95 plus um this is the 98 overall player or 99 overall gt player so this is the probability for this and of course it's going to be 2800 points and then we do have the other one which is the past release one that's 1700 points contains 393 plus overall elite players and either one times 96 overall elite player or one times 99 overall golden ticket player from any previous release um 1700 points and then this is the probability for the 93 plus and then the 96 overall or 99 overall golden ticket probability this is what this is going to be so that's going to be pretty much all as far as store offers involving golden tickets um, let's go check out, of course, the actual abilities and X factors so, for these cards. So we're going to head on over to Mud GG here. Good old Mud GG because I hate the catalog. If you know me, I hate the catalog. Sometimes the catalog doesn't even update. Sometimes the abilities aren't right. It's just always something wrong, but you can always count on Mud GG. So we're going to check out the first card. This William Perry here, really, really interested in seeing his release. And any other hidden stats that we didn't see so of course he's six foot two 335 pounds scrambler qb team chemistries he's bears and eagles um he does so they did keep his release so he does have traditional four so they didn't change his release thank god any other stats that we didn't know of okay so he has 94 juking he has 99 trucking which is insane 97 stiff arm and 96 change of direction 98 break tackle so those are some of the uh ratings that we didn't know before but now we know Next, let's check out the abilities here. So um, the price hasn't, okay, he sold for 2.6 mil, but he's probably gonna be a little bit cheaper than that. But his discount ability buck is he has Fearless for one AP, Gunslinger for zero, Human Joystick for zero, Pass Lead Elite for one AP, and then Tank for zero. His X Factor abilities, of course, these start on. Um, char charge Up Angry Runs for one, Bazooka for zero, Blitz Radar for one, Brick Wall for zero, Escape Artist for zero, First One Free for zero, Freight Train for zero, Gambit, um, high low dead eye pro reads running gun and then and then trues for zero ap so that's going to be his x factors all right and his last buckets so you can either get fearless or pass lead elite for one ap and then the other buckets you get skate artist gunslinger um human joystick and tank i'm gonna be honest with you i don't know why they put escape artists in these ability buckets whoever made this card was kind of 
thinking about last year, but Escape Artist is completely nerfed. It's not as good as it was last year. But if I had to go with this card, honestly, I would probably, because Fearless is for four AP here. So what I would, what I would do personally, I probably go past Lead Elite, and then I'll do Gunslinger, and then I go, and then I'll do Tank, and then I'll do Fearless. So all that for five AP essentially. That's that's how I would do it. Um, because of course, if you go with set fee, that's five. And then if you go with pass lead elite in any other bucket, I don't think it's available in any other bucket. So I would go pass lead elite. Yep. Gunslinger and tank. And then of course, fearless for, 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 for a total of five AP essentially. So that's what I would do. Um, the car, eh, it's, it's okay. It kind of, it could have been better. Um, I would have liked it without the escape artist, honestly. Like we could have got a better ability. Maybe Trues would have been fine. Like I would have loved Trues in this particular ability bucket, but you know, they didn't do that. They did escape artist. So it is what it is, but that is gonna be William Perry for you. Next up, we're gonna go over the Eddie Jackson free safety, 99 overall. Like I said, six foot, 206 zone safety. Um, team chemistry bears. He does have a secondary position, which is strong safety. Um, any ratings that we didn't know of before. So he has 88 catching, 99 pursuit, 97 hit power, 88 tackle. And he doesn't have hey, any James, blocks. Okay, available? so he has 70 block shit. So his block shit is decent. I don't think they upgraded that for Riffero though. Um, not too sure what they upgraded, to be honest with you. But that's going to be Eddie that Jackson and then his X Factor. So he's going for about uh, it, one, one already sold for about 1.4. He's probably going to be really cheap, but. His discount ability buckets is deep zone KO for zero, flat zone KO for zero, mid zone KO for zero, pick artist for one, and then tackle supreme for one AP. His X factors, um, charge up avalanche, reinforcement, run stuffer, um, sh shutdown, universal coverage, unstoppable force, and zone hawk. All that for, will be for zero AP. And of course, those start on. Now, his ability buckets, his last ability bucket, he gets tackle supreme or pick artist. So you can choose one of those for one AP. And then he has Avalanche, Deep Zone KO, Flat Zone KO, Mid Zone KO for zero. Um, and then, of course, the, the other bucket is the same. So essentially what I would do, I would probably run Tackle Supreme, Deep Zone KO, and Mid Zone KO. But if you're a part of the Avalanche meta, I would just run ta Tackle Supreme, Deep Zone KO, and then Avalanche. So that's how I would run it personally. But um, that's going to be it for the Eddie Jackson. So that's going to his, be his abilities. Next, we're going to do the Jalen Hurts. I did say this card was kind of underwhelming because they didn't boost the speed to 99. Like, like what was the point of this golden ticket? If you, if you weren't going to put this speed to 99. But he's 6'1", 223, improviser QB. Um, team Chemistry's Eagles, no secondary position, of course. He does have 88 carry, 90, 98 juke move, 93 spin, 88 truck, 88 stiff arm, 97 change of direction, 93 break tackle. I have no clue what, the, whoever made this card, I have no clue what they, what they boosted because they didn't boost the right stats. The right ratings at all um but let's check out his sales what has he sold for so it doesn't say so it's no auctions right now um but his discount ability is fearless for one gift rat for zero gunslinger for zero hot rod master for zero and then roman dead eye for one x factors angry runs for one bazooka for zero blitz radar for one brick wall for zero escape artist for zero first one free freight train gambit high low dead eye for zero and then charge up omaha for one ap running gun and then and, and then trues for zero ap so that's going to be the x factors for him now his billy buckets again why are they keep getting the qb's escape artists i do not know like who is making these cards <laughs> who is making these cards man um the last ability bucket you can get either fearless or roman dead eye for one and then the other buckets escape artists gift wrap gunslinger hot rod master for zero these are not good abilities. I'm not going to lie. If I had to run this card, honestly, like y'all just messed up this card badly. I don't know who, who, who created this, um, but I would probably go fearless. I don't even know. Like, this is crazy, bro. Like they didn't put set feed or nothing, not pass lead elite. No, honestly, I would just do fearless gunslinger. And if you're a hot route master person, I will run that. But if you're not, then I'll run gift gift wrap for zero and then fearless. And then go ahead. No, no, no. I'll go ahead and run fearless, gunslinger, gift wrap, and then set feed for five. Literally, so that I can have something. Cause outside of that, like they didn't even have any type of 
passing abilities, which is interesting. But, you know, that will be Jalen Hurts for you. <laughs> All right. Next up, we do have the OJ Howard. So I'm very curious about this card because I want to see if he has any run blocking, if they upgraded his run blocking. So he's 6'6", pretty tall receiver, 250 weight, deep threat wide receiver, team chemistry, Texans, Raiders, and Buccaneers. Um, no secondary position, of course. Now, ratings that we don't know. He has 99 juke. Okay. 99 carry, 98 trucking, 95 stiff arm, 94 change of direction, 93 break tackle. And he has 87 run blocking. Yes. Okay. So this is a really good, really good receiver. Really good. As long as the abilities check out, this is a really good receiver. With that 87 run block, that's really, really good. Um, now, did he sell on, on any platforms? So he's, he's selling for about 1.2, 1.3 right now. Now his abilities, he gets deep in elite discounted ability buckets, deep in elite for one, evasive for one, jukebox for zero, route tech for zero, short and elite for zero, and then right a wide receiver apprentice for zero, um, X factor abilities, angry runs for one, ankle breaker zero, double double me, uh, grab and smash, max security, rack them up, and then yak them up for zero. Okay, that's pretty good. Now his last bucket, let's check it out. So he gets deep in elite, and his last bucket, he gets deep in elite for one, or evasive for one. And then he gets jukebox, route tech, short in elite, or wide receiver apprentice. I like this combo. I like the combo. So if you wanna run a, if you wanna run a zero AP setup, you can essentially just run route tech and jukebox. Um, that's how I would run it. But if you wanna run a one AP setup, you can go evasive, route tech, and jukebox. So all depending on how you play, but this is a really good card though. So probably out of these cards, honestly, I will put OJ Howard number one, probably William Perry number two, and then Eddie Jackson at three, and then Jalen Hurst will, will probably be the last card that I would probably even think about getting. But let me know down in the comment section what you guys think of these um, golden tickets and if you're gonna pick up any of these. But if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you guys hit the like button, make sure you guys subscribe, make sure you guys continue to show love, and we'll catch you guys on the next one.